We're going to fill in a big, ugly, blank chart that goes on page 17 and 18. And guess what the next words out of my mouth are going to be? Thou shalt know thou shalt. You're required to memorize these two pages in their entirety. Your quiz next week will be if I gave you a blank one to fill in. Right? That's the logic of this. I can hear the groaning. I can hear the limbic system going. It is me. Okay, so this is your endocrine hormone chart from hell. So, we have the hormones and all these other things. So tell me what a hormone is in this context. Chemical messenger. It's a chemical that does something. Each one has a name or an abbreviation. You can give me one or the other and an answer. So now we got to figure out what a source is. What is a source of a hormone? The organ. The organ that secretes it, makes it, produces it. Where is it made? So where does it come from? Where is it made? Something, something gland. So they're made at the source. Can anyone guess what the target is? Where it goes, the effector. Where it goes. The target's what you hit. So I'm made at a source and I go to a target. Make sense? How do I get there? How do I get from a source to a target if I'm a hormone? Blood, right? It's in the blood, so the blood carries it from one place to the other. All right, we're going to skip over the action. What is the action of a hormone? What it does. What is that? I don't know what that is. What it does. So you're where you're made, where you go, and what you do are those three categories. The one you don't know anything about is type. That's the chemical typing. So over here. We're going to fill in the choices for the type column. So when you get to the type column, you have two choices to begin with. One of them is steroid. So some hormones are steroidal or steroid in type, chemical. Tell me what the other choice is. Non-steroid. Non Listen to you. You've heard this joke before. All right. So your first choice in the, in the type column is it a steroid or not, which is some chemistry from 112. If it's a non-steroid, you have additional question that you have to decide. One is amine is choice one. So if you're a non-steroid, you have an additional decision. The next one is peptide. If you remember your biology 112, you remember amines and peptides, monomer, polymer, kind of stuff. <coughs> So you're going to pick steroid or not. If you pick not, you have two other choices you have to make. That's what's going to go in the type column. Make sense? And you're going to write in stuff that you're going to remember for your quiz next week. So we're going to do the first row or two together to get the feel for this. So growth hormone. Because we're biologists and we're pretty dumb, we always put answers in the name. So growth hormone tells me an action. What does it do? Grow. Makes me grow. Yes, that's an A answer. Right? This is for you. I know what Saladin says. Makes this is for you. It me makes grow. me grow. <laughs> if I remember that, I'm going to work backwards. What's the target? Where would I grow? Everywhere. Bones are a target. Muscles are a target. All over is a target. So my bones and muscles are what I target to make me grow. Source. What, what thing makes growth hormone to go to my bones and muscles? Pituitary. Which one? Or two, the anterior pituitary. So for this class and for lab, you have to put both, or adenohypothesis to be fancy. The anterior pituitary is separate from the posterior. Then we're going to do type. So to make it easier, I'm going to abbreviate it as NSP. Can anyone guess what NSP stands for? Non-steroidal non peptide. So you can write NSP. And that would tell me you mean non steroidal peptide. Can we guess what the abbreviations for amines are? The NSA. It's for some kind of current event joke now, right? <laughs> NSA and SP are just shortcuts for saying non steroidal amine, non steroidal peptides. Make sense? Let's try the next one to get another handle here. Thyroid stimulating hormone. Gee whiz. Where's it made? Not made in your thyroid, no. Interior. It's made my anterior pituitary. Can anyone guess what the target of thyroid stimulating hormone is? Thyroid. The thyroid is the target. That's why we put it in the name. 
Can we guess the action of thyroid stimulating hormones? Stimulates my thyroid, increases activity of my thyroid, arouses my thyroid, activates my thyroid, stimulates, increases output thereof. <laughs> Whatever word you want for there. What type is it? Glad you don't know. That's why I have a job. It's an NSP. Good feeling? So you're going to write really simple answers that we will remember them for your quiz. But that's the kind of answer you're putting in this chart. Make sense? You have let's see, this is this. About 10 minutes to fill in as much as you can with your team. Divide and conquer. There are magic tables in your book and on your phone. Divide and conquer.